Welcome. So now we got a little problem where it's going to get a little more difficult because um, we see if we just multiply by the reciprocal of x over y, well, and we have y over x, then we have to apply distributive properties. So we're going to have to multiply that y over x times our 1 as well. And therefore, we're going to keep a, uh, keep a fraction inside of there. So there's a couple different ways uh, that we can do this. And one of the ways that we look at this in method one is just multiplying everything by your LCD of your denominator. So what we do is we look at each and every term and we determine what the denominator is. So we notice that each one of these whole numbers, we can just rewrite those as, that might look a little confusing, but as 1 over 1. So we know the denominator here is 1, denominator here is 1, and the denominator here is going to be y. So what we can do is out of 1, 1, and y, our LCD is going to equal y. So then what we'll do is we'll multiply every single term times y. So if we find out of each one of these terms, out of every single one of the terms, we find the LCD, then we multiply every term times y. Okay? And the reason why we do that is for a couple reasons. One, we know that we're going to eliminate now our denominators when we have, because y times x over y, the y divided by y divides into 1. Then here, we're just left with y times 1 over 1 is y divided by y plus x. And therefore, that's going to now be your simplified answer. Thanks.